covering the middle of the Sahara and northern Sahel. They live in harmony with the Wadabi. is the most expensive beast in the desert and every Wadabi aspires to own one. Although they haven't done any business, Quincy and Mina have had a great day at the races. But on their way back to the camp, they make a big decision regarding the Garawal which won't go down well with their wives. Next morning, back at the camp, Quincy and Mina are packing to go to the Garawal. They've told their wives that they can't go with them. Janari met the mother of his seven children at the Garawal. This year, Janari isn't going to the Garawal. He's staying at home with his family. But Quincy is finding it difficult to get away. After some heated discussions, Mariama and Yaya decide to obey their husbands. Mariama 
Leaving their wives behind, Quincy and Mina have made the long trek to the road where they hope to get a ride. They're in good spirits, but the morning's arguments have slowed them down, and if they don't get a lift soon, they'll miss the beginning of the festival. Over a thousand Wadabi have made their way to Chintabaradan for this year's Garawal. They've come from all over the Sahal, travelling for days to this isolated spot in the desert. Quincy and Mina have finally arrived at the event they've been waiting all year for. They meet relatives and old friends and exchange news. All over the camp, people are getting ready for the first dance. Then Quincy has a surprise. His new wife, Fatima, is at the festival with a friend. Because it is a Cobgill marriage, she won't start living with Quincy until the final ceremony in two months' time. Until then, Fatima is free to do as she chooses. <laughs> Single girls get the chance to choose lovers at the Garawal, but it's also an opportunity for unhappily married women to find a new husband. Quincy and Mina decide to get ready. Insides of old flashlight batteries make a useful but possibly harmful lipstick. The final touch is an ostrich feather placed on the turban. And this contestant has a talisman to ward off evil words. Quincy and Mina's group get together for a warm-up.
Finally, they're ready to perform their first dance. They make their way to the center of the action. Dancers believe that the chanting brings out their inner beauty, which helps to make them irresistible to women. check out the contestants. Quincy and his friends work hard to project their charms. Man's ability to roll his right eye in and out is a rare and highly rated talent. Mina uses this lip trembling technique. Women show their preferences with almost imperceptible glances.